Either way, that was... They should just make them all on. Instead of just resetting it, just turn them all on. But whatever, I'm not a game designer. Okay, I can see it from here. I'm just gonna take a picture of that with my phone. You can, you can see that there's two that are like blue and bigger than the other ones, so that should help figuring it out. I'm gonna do that design first. Well, I don't know. It might, like, mess up if I try that one first. I'll just solve the normal one, and then I'll solve that one. Assuming it lets me, because if it just turns off, I'm gonna be real mad. Oh. Ooh. Bro, you're really just gonna find whatever. Maybe this will be fun. Alright. Yeah. Dead and Haunted. Yeah, look at all that healing, dude. Look at how many tentacles we got, dude. Uh, let's see. I want to see what six looks like. All right, there we go. Six tentacles. We got like an extra one in the back. Alright, time for some heartbreaker. Um, I guess I'll defend just because he's about to attack. And no damage at all. Oh, this is gonna be so nice. This team's gonna be so nice. I don't think this team does as much damage as the last one did. Just because I'm not focusing on crit at all. I'm just doing base damage. Uh, but, I mean, just look at us. We have no damage taken now. And Alawi just, even when she wasn't defending, took like nothing from that dude's attacks. I think we're in a really good spot. Um, wait a minute. This is a different puzzle because this one, the one that we just took a picture of, has only two blue pylons. Well, this one has three. So. And they're in different spots. So I think this is a different. I think this this might actually be the, the puzzle from over here. Like at the start of the room. Uh. Let me, let me go check real quick. We killed this guy, so it shouldn't take us too long. Uh, yeah, this only has... Yep, this, this has got to be the one. Alright. Open my handy dandy phone. So we have to make... I wish I could show you guys, but I guess I'll show you by solving it. Wait, can I not move them? I swear. Why can't I move them? This is the one. Like this is the this is the there's one blue here and one blue here. That is that is sad. Okay, well, I guess it won't let me touch it. Maybe I have to unlock the next one first. I don't know, dude. Or maybe there's just a third puzzle somewhere that we haven't found because we haven't opened the door.
Whatever. Alright. Still over there. Looks like it's still got a charge. I sense the presence of Nankaboros. The Buru Forge must be near. Yes. The entire facility is powered by it. This technology is far beyond what the Vasani could have accomplished alone. The Blessed Isles. Truly, they were magnificent. Emphasis on were. Let's hurry so Bilgewater doesn't suffer the same fate. Sparked conversations. I might as well. It'll make that annoying golem spawn back, but whatever. Gone. Join me. Oh my gosh! So you want to hear the story of the lighthouse again? No, no stories. I give you a hard time, but you keep on sticking your neck out for me. Then. Uh, Mostly just my shield. <laughs> How about a toast? To friendship. You truly mean it? Ask me your gourd. <laughs> By the old gods, Brom cannot feel his face. <laughs> Good stuff, huh? It's from Ionia. Helps calm the nerves. Brom must uh, sit. Which way is the ground? <laughs> <laughs> You've got a new story to tell. The mighty Brom, felled by a drink. We... <sighs> will never speak of this. <laughs> Let's go! Yasuo's come around to Brom. And we also know the Brom is, I guess, a lightweight. In terms of drinking. Which is weird considering his body composition, but you know. We should rest. So should you. Though it is difficult, I admit, knowing our enemy does not need any. Yeah, a real weakness of being human, the whole sleep thing. I suppose you see less of it these days with your new responsibilities. Running Bilgewater? Huh. Piece of cake. Is it? <sighs> Even when I do rest, it never comes easy. Too much of what I've seen follows me into the dark. Probably the same for all of us. Real responsibility is the death of pleasant dreams. Once I've taken care of mine, I wonder what I'll see when I close my eyes. Hmm. Perhaps you will dream again. <laughs> Imagine that. Wow, that was a really... That was a... Pretty crazy thing. I just got an achievement uh, called Good Listener. So... That might have actually been the last set of rest conversations. Alright. We know this. I have it on my phone. I can't really show you guys very well, but you'll see it in a second when I finish it. I have to make kind of like a rectangle with these bottom two, and the top two, and then make a bunch of crosses in the middle up here. So... There. So that one goes there. 
one. Oh no. There we go. Ta da! Treasure chest. I guess there really is no wrong way to do this puzzle if you just go one at a time. Cool. Boy, really? What are all these places have such silly trinkets and oddities in them? Where is the steel? Looks like a fox. Alright, is this one of those stones you're looking for? Yes, yeah, it's a token card from a fossilized egg by someone who was using Yamello's techniques. I can feel the soul burning inside. I knew we'd find more little fox. Ice fox token? Ooh! Orb of Destruction. I want to say that's a League item name, but I could be wrong. Dang. That was a bunch of health. Actually, it really does suck. But I got a ton of damage and some crit. I'll take it. Cool. What does she do now? It's an extra like 200 damage on this. Uh, lots of healing. Oh, there, there you go. That, that's like an extra thousand almost. Fog. She might die in one hit, but she'll go faster, so that's cool. Um, and then we also got. Uh, yeah, this, I think. Oh, and a sprocket necklace. Whoa, wait a minute. Physical defense. It's a lot of physical defense, but I still don't know if that's worth it. Because what it gives me instead of, like, I lose attack power and stamina, which are both really strong. Or a little bit of crit and evade, which is basically useless on both. Plus, I lose the the chance of a shield. I think I'll keep Banshee's Veil. It just... It sounds like kinda okay, but not a good enough. Alright, let's move on. The glyphs are mostly indecipherable, but a small section remains intact. Our research has largely been a success. The white mist, or hallowed mist as it's been called, has proven vital to our investigation to memory spells and storage. And we will move on to the next phase in our golem trials before it abruptly cuts off. That golem looks awesome, by the way. I'm gonna hate fighting it, probably, but it looks awesome. The massive arcane edifice seems similar, if far larger, than those you've seen before. While it is currently on standby, you can tell that it's meant to receive sunstones. The black mist has corrupted much of what was here. But, I can use this device to transfer memories into the empty sunstone I recovered in Thresh's library. There is a wealth of Vasani knowledge here. The secrets of my people, the connection with my past that I've been searching for all this time. There are many things Brom wishes he could remember. <laughs> Ari, what of the ruined king's memories? Would it be possible to put those into the sunstone? Yes, but it would be at the cost of the Vasani's research, the last remaining memories of them. Yet, with the Ruined King's secrets in the Sunstone, we'd be able to turn them against him. Use his shame, his regret as a weapon. We've all seen the devastation that Lovesick Shade is capable of. If we've got even the slightest chance of hitting him where it hurts, we have to take it. This isn't your choice to make, Fortune. Yasuo, Sarah is right. 
We can't let this opportunity go to waste. Can you access the Ruined King's memories? Yes. I can feel them spiraling in my mind like some kind of infection. His secrets. I can isolate them. That's sad. It's smart, because I didn't think about that at all. But it is sad. All along, I thought I was cursed. I was ashamed of my true nature. Afraid of what I might be. But now I see. I simply misunderstood. The Vasani. They saw the potential in our abilities. A purpose. The Ruined King's memories. His pain. I can feel them in my mind. I know his secret. The dark, rotten truth at his core. His fear. His pain. I will make it our weapon. I can sense the power coming from the stone. She's done it. Yes. All that hate, doubt, and fear. It's ours to use against the Ruined King. Let's go! Oh. protects the chamber, and we are intruders. Big boy, let's fight. Go arms, friends. Ancient Construct. Dude, okay. I make fun of Ari a lot, and she deserves it personally, but that cutscene just now is probably the best cutscene in this game so far. Like, that was really cool. Like, the, the sparkle design on her eyes, like, showing the, the memory orb and stuff, like, that was, that was a really solid cutscene right there. Anyway, uh, big boy, uh, Muta stuns, just takes 30% less damage because why not, and has 30% haste, uh, deals damage to itself and buys vulnerable. Oh. Until the next turn has a long recovery time only used after obliterate is interrupted. Uh, deals damage and increases haste by 10%. Uh, deals light damage. Applies random debuff to each champion. That sucks. But we can we can take those away. And then obliterate deals fatal damage, so one shots us. Can be interrupted if attacked twice by champions with point of failure. Having a backfire. Okay, what is Point of failure. I guess we'll just have to find out. Alright, Miss Fortune! Too slow. Damage. Oh, she got a shield. Let's go. All right. I wonder who the tap. Uh, it's gonna do. It's gonna do the AOE. This ends. So, in response, I'm gonna go ahead and get this set up on everybody. I did that because of the extra healing, but I guess it doesn't really need it now. Whatever. Um... What is it about to do? Oh, it's disorienting again. I still don't know what point of failure is. They don't have it. 
no, that's not really good. Great. Luck's running out. Yeah, bud. Uh, we have all three ult points ready. Okay, let's just add oh. more dots. Oh, there we go. That's a point of failure. Okay, I need... Okay, yeah. I need... Crap, I don't know. That's a, that's a good one. Ari can. That's too slow. There we go. Boom. That should be two points of failures. One time. And. Two times. So it should stop it, right? And backfire? Yeah! So now he takes a lot more damage. Oh, I need to hit him with everything right now. Time to die. I guess we probably should have set that animation up. <laughs> Alright, Ari. Hit him with Devour. Well, that way I know you don't do damage, but... Harsh lesson. Misfortune? Uh... Shredder? You've got three stacks. It's Strut, so... Big chomp. Ooh, 35 black marks. Armor for Braum. Like I said, like we don't do as much damage as we used to, but we don't die. This team is super resilient. 